We're revisiting Blair's social second. Uh, it is more on a serious note this morning. Uh, as we've been reporting to you, 19 children and two adults killed in a South Texas school. Uh, many of those victims, uh, some of them still in the hospital this morning. We asked you all uh, what policies or changes could be made to make you feel safe, uh, sending your children to school and also keeping those teachers safe. We heard from hundreds of you this morning on this topic. Rebecca Austin says keeping minimal entrances, keeping them locked under surveillance and showing ID. We do not need guns within the schools that will not stop it might keep the death toll down but we need to stop things before they happen we also heard from melissa schmidt keisler this morning she said i think the issue is lack of mental health in our country for all if schools and the country uh, can get better screening tools there would be fewer issues. Uh, she says the fact is mass shootings are from people who need better access to mental health options. We also heard from Danielle Butler. Uh, she says she teaches at an elementary school. Security guards would be preferred. There have been issues with people in the community who disregard signs about not being on school property during the day. So hundreds of answers for you all. We would like you to weigh in on this topic. As many of you, our viewers, are parents, visit our Facebook page, Fox 2 Now. We'll be right back after this.